If you have been training for the Old Mutual Two Oceans Ultra Marathon or Half Marathon with a specific goal in mind, your best chance of success is to run with a pacing bus on race day. The pace setters are literally what the name says. We set the pace. If you've got a goal or even if you don't know what you want to run during the race, you most probably would know what your capability is to run. And throughout the race, we will keep this pace to set a goal for runners to come in at a certain time. The pace setters can be found at the start of the Old Mutual Two Oceans Ultra Marathon and Half Marathon. You can identify them by the flags they carry, printed with their names and their finishing time. We're getting some kits, we're getting shoes, and we're getting our running uh, vests, and those who haven't got Coleman yet, they're getting Coleman. It's all actually for us to stand out on the day so that people can know we are the pace setters, and also to be able to keep time. So, so far we're doing good, we have good yeah. passengers. Everybody says hi, good morning, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Being a pace setter is no easy task, and each of the Old Mutual Two Oceans Marathon bus drivers is an athlete in their own right. So the vibe in the bus is good. I'm holding on for dear life, but I'm having a good time. The guys are amazing here. So many talented athletes in Cape Town. I've played Nepal for 16 years for Western Province, and I needed a change, so I started doing rugby. I was pulled up into the SA Select team for the Sevens. It's a women's team and it's full on rugby, tackles, everything. They're actually very good runners, but they're giving up their only races with just other people. Runners do it better in groups. Pace setting is a huge responsibility as many runners rely on the pacing buses to achieve their goals. There's a lot of people that depends on, on, on pace setters. If you sidestep, even for a water break also, everybody watch where is the pace setter now. It is that flag coming because they following that flag. The special part of it is helping people. People say like, that's the guy that brought me in for my first marathon, that helped me for my personal best time. Weather conditions are good, the bus is good, everyone is feeling good, we're all for spot on. I just love what I experience on the run to give it to other people. I can remember my first one, so whenever I'm running and I've got novices in the bus, I can remember how it was. The nice part of pacing is the smiles, the high fives, selfies and the hugs. What a man, what a man! You can't not enjoy Two Oceans Marathon and Half Marathon. It's the most enjoyable run. I would definitely recommend that the runner join the pace setting bus on race day. The biggest benefit is that there's no guesswork. The time that you see on our flags is the time that we will bring you. It's very good for the runners to introduce themselves already on the start of the race because the runners are behind you. You can't see the runners and you just have to keep your strategy. If you think joining a pacing bus is just what you need to achieve your old mutual Two Oceans Marathon goal, then look out for the pace setters that will be running your goal time either at the start or as you settle into your pace in the early stages of the race. Good luck and enjoy your run.